If you are on your mobile device right now, smoothly scrolling through all of the boring videos on YouTube, and you also have a personal computer, be it a Windows or a Mac, you may have noticed that on your Mac or Windows, some apps don't scroll quite as smoothly as they do on your iPhone or Android device. We're going to fix that today. I'm going to show you exactly how you can set up your operating system to enable smooth scrolling across all of the apps and i'll be using a mac to show you this but this works equally well across mac and windows operating systems before we dive in let's take a quick look at the differences between janky scrolling and buttery smooth scrolling here i'm on x formerly twitter and this website is a great example of how scrolling can make a difference. So right now I have smooth scrolling disable on my Mac and we can get a good sense for how janky scrolling can be. All right, so here I'm going to start scrolling. All I'm really doing is basically scrolling with the mouse wheel. And... Yeah, this is the best we can get. Now let's try it with smooth scrolling enabled. Here we go. Please tell me you can notice the difference and that you prefer this last example, okay? Because otherwise this video does not make sense. Now that we agree that smooth scrolling is much better, let's dive in on how to set that up. This is option one of the two options that I'm going to present to you today to enable smooth scrolling. No pun intended. This is Logitech Logi Options Plus. I would not recommend this unless you have a Logitech input device, be it a mouse or a touchpad. So if that's the case, you likely already have Logi Options or Logi Options Plus, and you're good to go. By the way, I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. I just don't know how you would pronounce that. In any case, if you have a Logitech mouse or a touchpad, you likely already have this software. Otherwise, you can download it, set it up for your device, and from there, you'll be able to select the scroll direction and enable smooth scrolling. Easy peasy, all done. However, if you don't have a Logitech input device or you want better smooth scrolling, even if you have a Logitech peripheral, let's go next. This is by far my favorite, smooth scroll. Smooth scroll is not sponsoring this video or paying me for this. I simply love the app and it's very lightweight. It's customizable, it's unintrusive and it just works. It actually provides smooth scrolling across all apps. What you'll do here, you'll select your operating system, either Mac or Windows. You'll download it and run it, and it will walk you through what you need to do to set it up. I have already done that on my computer, on my Mac. I'll show you that here right now. Here it is. And all I have to do here is enable it for all apps or disable it for all apps and uh, I get this kind of smooth scrolling. Once this is installed, all of your apps just will be scrolling smoothly and it will be a much better experience. But now for the final thing that I promised you, if you have a website and you want to enable smooth scrolling, this will allow your visitors to scroll your website smoothly, even if they don't have smooth scrolling enabled for their operating system. This is one of the articles I wrote as a uh, preamble to this video. Towards the end, you'll see this section. The first option, if you're using Tailwind CSS, scroll smooth on your HTML attribute is all you need. If not, you can add scroll behavior smooth to your HTML attribute there at the bottom. And if that's not an option for you, you can use this JavaScript uh, snippet. I will also say that if you are on WordPress, uh, there are plugins you can use to enable this behavior. What this will do is that your website will scroll smoothly even if the user does not have that set up in their computer. I hope you found this helpful, but if you didn't, please let me know in the comments because as a relatively new YouTuber, I want to make sure that my content provides direct value to you.